What is going on fellow nerds? And after nearly a year of bad plumbing by Samsung, I'm talking to the leaks and drips and rumors that we've heard about the Note 9 for the past year. We finally know everything there is to know about the Note 9. I'm gonna tell you the five things you need to know about the Note 9 right after this. What is going on fellow nerds and welcome back. It is me Jamoka Cobbs from Sounds Nerdy. Samsung finally unpacked the Note 9 today and I'm going to give you five things you need to know about it. So let's dive right into it. The first thing, let's talk about the specs, the hardware on this phone. This phone is a beast. First off, we're talking about a 6.4 inch screen. Um, that is compared to the 6.3 inch screen from the previous Note, the Note 8. It's still the same size, but you still have a bigger screen. So that is another plus from Samsung on that one. The phone starts at 128 gigabytes compared to 64 gigabytes for the previous Note 8. And there's also a 512 gigabyte version. And of course, there's also an expandable memory slot with that as well. Samsung will plan on releasing a 512 gigabyte SD card. So you're talking about having one terabyte of memory on your Note 9. Outrageous. The next thing is the AKG stereo speakers on the Note 9. Finally, the Note has stereo speakers. Um, they're bringing that over from the S9, obviously, so it'd be great to finally get some stereo sound when I'm actually watching videos on my Note 9, so I'm looking forward to that. And last thing we're gonna cover in the spec category is the battery. The Note 9 has a 4,000 milliamp battery compared to the 3300 from the Note 8. So that is a huge upgrade. So now you're definitely talking about your battery lasting all day. Right now I can get just about a full day's charge on this. Um, but with that 4,000 milliamp battery, I will be able to probably go, you know, greater than a day. So definitely look forward to that. Number two, let's talk about the camera. Now the camera hardware itself is pretty much the same as the S9 Plus camera, but they've done some things on the software side to make it a little bit better. First of all, we're talking about the intelligent camera. Um, when you're getting ready to take pictures, this will now detect if there are flaws with your pictures, such as somebody's closing their eyes or it's, a, it's blurry or smudge or anything. The camera will now alert you and let you know that there's something going on so you can actually correct the situation before you actually take that picture and you don't have to retake that. So that is another key thing. Also, uh, with the attached camera, it's going to optimize the scene for the best picture quality. So right now it has like 20 or so scenes that it recognizes. So it will be able to determine what scene it is and then automatically do things like color correction, sharpness, or whatever it needs to make your picture more pop. Number three, Fortnite. Yes, we've heard about Fortnite being a Samsung exclusive, and now we know the final detail that Fortnite will be a time exclusive. Um, starting today, August 10th, you will be able to join in on a beta if you have a Samsung Galaxy device. Um, specifically like the 7 Edge and up, and then you have the Tab S4, I believe the S3 or something like that. So you will be able to participate in the beta for that as well. So Fortnite is coming to Android if you have the Galaxy device. So number four, let's talk about the S Pen. The S Pen has received a significant upgrade. The S Pen will now have Bluetooth embedded in there. So Bluetooth Low Energy to be specifically. So what that means now is that I can actually use my pen in the Note 9 to actually do stuff with it, not just write on the screen. This actually will become a remote control. I can actually take pictures with it. I can go through slideshows with it. Um, if you do a lot of Snapchatting or whatever, it can take snaps for you. So that is a nice feature for the upgraded S Pen. Um, being that it is Bluetooth, so it does have a battery in there, Samsung said that this pen will fully charge in less than a minute, 40 seconds to be precise, and it will last up to a half hour. That is some good stuff. And you should be able to operate the pen up to 30 feet in standard conditions, obviously, optimal conditions to be more specific. And last bit of information, number five that I'm going to talk about is the release information. So the phone will drop August 24th. Pre-order starts today, August 10th. You can jump on whatever carrier you want to and start to pre-order that. Um, the price, 
for the 128 gigabyte version would be 999 so you're looking at a thousand dollars now so more expensive than the previous note was and the 512 gigabyte version will be twelve hundred and forty nine dollars Woo! that is a steep price tag for that but for those of you out there who want to store you know a lot of pictures or data or whatever on your phone then you probably want to get the 512 um, option I will probably stick with the 128 and just get an SD card but that's my logic um, it will come in four different colors ocean blue which comes with a yellow S pen actually looks sweet loving that contrast on there um, lavender purple metallic copper and midnight black Yep, and that is the five things I wanted you to know about the Note 9 that was fully unveiled today. I want to thank you for taking the time to watch this video. If you enjoyed this video, make sure you hit that like button. And while you're at it, subscribe. And when you subscribe, make sure you hit that notification bell so you can be notified when we put out new videos. I have been Jamoka. You can follow me on Twitter at SNJamoka. Make sure you also follow Sounds Nerdy on Twitter, at Sounds Nerdy. We have a lot of conversations on Twitter that do not make it into our videos. So if you want to be a part of that, make sure you follow us on Twitter. Also, check out our Facebook group over at our Facebook page, at Sounds Nerdy. Uh, we talk about a lot of things on there as well, tech and game related. So make sure you check that out. And until the next video, guys, stay nerdy.